Good morning, Lisa. This is the 2013 Mazda CX-5 GT that you inquired about. All-wheel drive. It's got the uh, beautiful fog lights in the front, as well as that, that aggressive look. Um, and then here you got your alloy rims. Um, as you can tell, the tires are practically brand new. Really, really good condition. Uh, the condition of the vehicle itself overall is fantastic. And then in the back, uh, let's open up the trunk over here. Got lots of room. Spare tires under here. Uh, you got a power outlet as well. And then uh, this, you pull on it, seats go forward. So if you need uh, that extra length for um, longer uh, materials, um, you have it. Uh, you have a quick access to it. Same with this one, uh, you got actually the middle one that goes down and then you got the one on the, uh, the one on the one end. Here you got the light. So at night time you do have a cargo light in the back. Uh, backup camera. You got the back wiper blade. Um, and then, oh, go ahead. I left it locked. So I just want to show you the condition of the outside of the vehicle. It's in really, really good condition. I'm going to go step inside. So as soon as you come inside, you got your power windows, power locks, as well as your power mirrors. Uh, power seats on beautiful leather, black leather seats with the red stitching. Um, as well as you got the amazing Bose sound system in the vehicle. Uh, over here you got your blind spot detect, uh, detection system on and off, traffic control. Um, if you def decide to change the um, tire pressure in the vehicle, you can adjust that uh, so your lights don't go on. And this one's your um, so an automated um, lighting system for nighttime. Gives you better lighting for uh, on the road for light. Uh, on the steering wheel, you got your radio controls as well as your uh, voice command and uh, to dial out uh, phone calls. And then on the uh, right side, you have the cruise control. Uh, you also have auto headlights, so you'll never have to turn them on or off. Uh, it does it all by itself. Also, you do have um, your wiper blade control on this side, which does have the auto as well, which has rain sensors. So once it detects uh, water on the windshield, it'll automatically uh, turn the wipers on. And the more rain you have on it, uh, the quicker the blades go. Um, as well as you got the push start, which is running right now, which I can actually turn off. And then put your foot on the brake. Push the push start. And then it starts. As you can tell, there's no lights that stay on the dash. It's only got 49,000 kilometers. So you, you still have some warrant, or, uh, lots of powertrain warranty left. Uh, pretty sure you have a little bit of comprehensive. I'll have to double check with that. Uh, up here, you have your um, your screen. Sorry, it's just an early morning for me today. Uh, so you do have your audio, uh, your phone. You can connect your phone to it, as well as you have navigation. Uh, it is touch screen. Uh, agree so you do have the map and then down here you got your four ways of course um, sorry right here um, to change your um, your clock it's a lot easier it's just these three buttons uh, you have the dual climate as well as auto uh, your heated seats and then uh, you do have your uh, automatic with tiptronic which is a nice feature if you uh, need to keep it in the gear or decide to, um, you can. Uh, very easy. Here's automatic. Push it over and now you're in Tiptronic. You'll know from up here. See, drive means automatic. I slide it over. We're manual. Um, you can only go uh, so many gears unless you're at the proper uh, speed. And then um, you have the sunroof. Very easy to control. It's all auto. and then uh, close it.
you have to hold it to close. And then if you push on it, the vent opens and gives you that extra little bit of air. Um, so as you can tell with the seats down, you got lots of room. And if you have any more questions, uh, please uh, let me know. Thank you.